sizes like trying something on from that website or from any website really because then you kind of know how they fit and work in person so today i'm gonna be trying on a crap ton of stuff from zoffel i got so many things for summer i got a bunch of bathing suits one pieces bikinis i got dresses which i'm not sure one of the dresses i got even though it fits absolutely perfect because i'm wearing it for my birthday we're just gonna go through the bikinis so first of all i have the high cut plunge neck swimsuit this is so cute oh my gosh like the second i put it on me and my friend and both kind of just oh my gosh because it looks so nice on it's so elegant it looks exactly like the pictures fits perfect i'm a size small by the way so everything that i got except for one dress that was sold out in my size i got in the small just in case you're wondering now this bathing suit oh my gosh okay so it's called the zaful backless plunging high leg swimsuit i was excited about this one because it goes up super high on the hips which i like because it makes it look like you have hips if you don't i don't but my is literally out like these things do not have anything to cover your lady parts like I don't know what they were really thinking or who has lady parts that thin but those are for like Stassi or something on Instagram like that can pull that look off because I don't know I didn't feel comfortable in it I don't feel comfortable in it I would only ever wear it with shorts or something like out walking on the strip at the beach I would never wear it as an actual bathing suit oh my goodness okay so next I have the ribbed backless candy swimsuit oh my gosh I love this the texture is so it's like that rib texture obviously so it's like super um nice feeling and like it feels better quality than they obviously are because they're pretty cheap bathing suits they're all made in hong kong or something but i love this i love the back of it i think it's so cute and i just love white because it makes you look super tan next i got the thai underwire balconette oh my god i definitely said that wrong wow bikini set this is so cute i've gotten so many compliments that i look good in orange so i thought hey i'm gonna try and get a bright orange freaking bathing suit and it's actually so cute i think it fits so well i love the ties at the side because you can make the bottoms fit literally anyone any size and they're super cheeky as well which i really do appreciate <laughs> now this one this is the cross marble lace up bikini set and i like both of the pieces but i wouldn't wear them together if that makes sense i feel like it's too much um of the marble design in one place for some reason. I'd wear the bottoms with a black top or the top with black bottom, that kind of thing, but I don't think it looks too good together. Oh my gosh, okay, so this one. It's called the Shell Cutout Halter Bikini Set. And it is so cute, like one of the cutest bathing suits I've ever owned. But I literally broke off one of the shells the second I took it out of the bag. And I swear, I, I was so gentle with them and I was being so careful because I know how delicate things can be. And now I've broken off two of the shells trying it on another time. So I'm gonna sew them on myself again. All of the shells just kind of reinforce them just to make it last longer. Because I think it's such a cute bathing suit and it has such good potential. Just the shells aren't put on very well. So be mindful of that. This next one is called the Ribbed Braided cut out bikini set it's so cute i love am i gonna say anything other than cute it's so nice <laughs> i love the back of it i think it's so cute the way that they're like braided almost a couple of the strings and some of them aren't and it's also ribbed the material which like i really enjoy for some reason on bathing suits and i love the color of this one the baby blue will look so good okay these bottoms oh my gosh they are the most cheeky bottoms i've ever owned in my life they're called cheeky high leg bikini bottoms they were 6.99 so like obviously i I had to get them and they are so cheeky like the front is the exact same as the back and they're perfect for tanning like perfect for tanning so i'm so happy about these pair it's just a basic staple black pair of tanning bottoms you know oh my gosh <laughs> so i tried they're called seam highlight bikini bottoms i don't know why i thought that like super high waist like they do not look exactly like the picture so in the picture you can see that they're like high waisted but they're not super long the actual waist part but when i tried them on like you'll just see for yourself they're not they're not cute i hate them I'm not gonna lie, I really hate them. All right, so we're gonna move on to the dresses now. So the first dress that I got was the side slit satin A-line cami dress in red. 
head. And in the picture, it looked super cute, super light, flowy, satin material. But in person, it's a lot thicker than I was expecting, which means it doesn't kind of flow and like sit on your curves like you want it to. So it kind of makes me look like a square or like a door, like a box, Amazon box, something like that, you know, no curves whatsoever. But personally, I think it's just because my body type, it just doesn't really look good to me on my body. So maybe someone with like some voluptuous curves would look so good in this dress. I've seen some reviews and some of the pictures the girls put up were gorgeous. So honestly, I think this one's just on me, just not shopping well for my body type in my opinion. But if you have my body type and like you want to wear it, I mean, go do you. Like freaking, I don't think it looks that bad. I just, it doesn't make me look as good as I know I can. Oh my gosh, okay. This dress, I saw it and I had to get it no matter what. Even though I'm a size small and sometimes that's awful, the smalls don't even fit me. I got it in a medium because I was like, there's no way I'm not risking losing this dress. It's so gorgeous. It's so sparkly. The top fits me perfect, but I do think that I'll have to take in the back and like the sides a little bit and maybe shorten it a tiny bit just to flatter my body a little more and obviously fit better because you can tell at the back, like bottom, it doesn't fit quite perfect. So I actually already hemmed the dress. I made it shorter, I took in the sides, I made it a little bit tighter around the waist by adding a clear strap thingy. Once I do the straps, it'll be perfect. I'm wearing this for my friend's birthday and it's gonna be so good. Oh my gosh, it's gonna be so pretty. So elegant, fancy kind of, but it's cheap. So like, damn, I'm really happy about it. And the straps are really cute and they're removable for washing as well in case you were wondering. Next one's my birthday dress. So I'm not showing sure you guys that. <laughs> okay, this one I thought would be so cute for summer, but when I was looking at the reviews, I was kind of nervous because the boob part looked a little bit wide. Like it would come out if you didn't have enough boob to fill it, I guess. But when I got it, oh my gosh, I'm in love with this dress. I think it will look so freaking girly and cute. I love the way it flows when you spin around and how you can pick it up and like swing it and stuff like that I think it's so cute and I love pink. Pink's my favorite color and that baby pink color Don't even get me started. Like I love that color. Anyone could look good in this dress. I swear get it This next piece reminds me of that one bathing suit I said the marble one how like I would love the pieces but I would never wear them together. And that's exactly how I feel about this. Like I even wore the skirt today to school and I thought it was so cute, but I feel like with the shirt, it looks like too much, like too much plaid together. That's just my opinion. Honestly, I feel like it's cute. And if you think it would look good together, wear it, wear whatever you want. But I personally think on me, especially, it just looks like way too much plaid in one place. I honestly forgot that I got these things, but I ended up like ordering some sunglasses and necklaces and stuff too. So these are the first pair of sunglasses. They're really cute. I'll put the names and stuff on the screen. Um, yeah, they're uh, really cheap feeling, but like they were really cheap, so it makes sense. Um, these are the next pair. I was super excited about them. I think they're cute. I had them way too up my nose at first, but yeah, they're really cute. Um, and then this is the last pair of sunglasses. They're also really freaking cute. These are supposed to just be for like pictures and stuff, I guess. They won't really protect me from the sun at all. And they all came in different cases, which was weird, but yeah. Um, this is the first necklace. It's just a ball and a rose on like two different chains. It's super cute. Um, the second one I got solely for the necklace because it was handcuffs and it's super cool. Um, but it also came with these really ugly earrings that I will honestly never wear like you. Um, I got this choker with like a little um, heart pearl thing. And then these is a necklace and bracelet together. So that's everything that I got from Zaful. I honestly really liked like almost all of it. I would return some of it, but they were too cheap to return. So I'm just gonna see if other people want them or something. But yeah, if you like this, go ahead and like and like subscribe. Cause I have like none, but like, yeah. Okay, bye.